Hello everyone, I would like to show you how I have modified my HP ProBook 4540S laptop into a very versatile machine with four different operating systems plus a shared data partition. We go, this is my boot screen and you can see that there are um, Windows 8 and Mac OS X Yosemite. The recovery HD that is useful if you want to uh, re um, recover your system from a time machine backup, for example. Okay, and then I have um, uh, 30 gigs of shared partition um, to share data uh, in between all those operating systems. So that is installed on the main hard drive, that is a 750 gig um, standard hard drive, rotational hard drive. Um, what I did next, I have installed um, a second hard drive where the optical hard drive was. So I removed the optical hard drive and I placed my uh, hard drive on, um, on this panic case. This is an SSD hard drive, very, very fast, 560 gigs. And uh, I installed on this hard drive um, Mavericks, so Mac OS 10.9.5. Um, and you will see now that on the boot screen, uh, there will be two more icons. Um, for the new hard drive, yeah, let's say second hard drive, um, that I call it Packintosh. There we go, so there is Packintosh, the second hard drive um, installed, uh, and this is the recovery HD for Packintosh. So this is a very versatile um, situation because I can um, if I need, I can take with me uh, the, the, the second hard drive and uh, if I need somewhere or whatever. And uh, also have um, all the operating system on the same machine if I want. Okay, so let's have a look at Windows 8. Okay, this is Windows 8 uh, loading. Here we go, um, Windows 8.1 Password A welcome screen Here we go um, Windows 8 is um, nice operating system, it's a bit tricky, it's a bit different from the other ones, so it takes a bit of time to to see where um, all the menus, have, all the functions and everything, but um, it takes a bit of time, but you, for example, on the right, yeah, here on the right we have the um, power options, yeah, so we're going to restart, and we're going to move to the next one, uh, that is Fedora. Fedora is a Linux distribution, and uh, it's a very, very stable operating system. Um, is completely open source, so um, everyone is free to, to, to add their skills to any of the applications um, they are distributed. Um, and there's a lot of uh, nice features on um, Fedora. Everything runs really smooth and um, and this is Fedora password. Boom, okay. This is the Fedora window, screen, and those are the applications. Um, as I said, there are many, many um, nice features. All of them are open source, so um, free to download, to modify and redistribute if you're willing to do that. Okay. Um, let's restart. And let's move to Mac. Okay, 
Okay, we're going to make a stand, Yosemite. Um, and you will see that um, it will take a bit of time compared to the Mac OS installed on the second hard drive and that depends on the hard drive because this hard drive is um, a standard rotational hard drive uh, while the other Mac OS system is installed on the SSD hard drive it's a very it's much much faster you will see in in terms of booting time and loading applications but here we go okay expecting guest user Yosemite screen and you can see the launch point yeah all the applications are, um, works really well um, system preferences Let's restart. Let's just uh, let's, let's 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 move on. Okay. Um, now we're going to let's restart. We're going to uh, we're going to move to the second hard drive. Uh, so the one is told um, um, where the optical drive was, and that I call Packintosh. Okay. As I said, this is uh, will be too really really quick. And uh, I have installed here Mavericks uh, 10.9.5. Very, very fast. Okay, guess user. There we go. And this is Maverick. So now we are on a second hard drive. Uh, just some preferences. Uh, let's have a look at. Um, some of the uh, specification, um, more info, like we brought, um, we can see the processor 2.49, then the different partitions as Mac, and titled is uh, basically is Windows and data. It doesn't read uh, Linux, but there's Linux as well. Packintosh is just down. Um, this data are the 30 gig, 29.4 gig of uh, shared um, data partition. And then we have a gig of um, memory. Okay, we're gonna we're going to restart, and that is um, pretty old. So um, I'm really happy with this machine. I have many options. I can switch from one operating system to the other one very easily. Um, so I strongly suggest you to, to try to, to do the same thing on your machine if you're willing to do that. I provided all the links I have used um, to do that. Everything is on the web. Um, this is Clover, uh, um, the Clover boot, bootloader, Clover bootloader, um, and uh, I used the Clover configurator as well. Um, so I hope you will enjoy this video and uh, have fun. And if you liked it, please feel free to share with others. Take care.